Today on the channel, Power of the Force Collection, Complete Galaxy, Ewok, Endor. Welcome everyone, Kyle here, back again for our daily Star Wars unboxing. And today we've got the Star Wars Complete Galaxy, Endor with Ewok. But for all your modern day Star Wars needs, hit up Big Bad Toy Store, link in the description below. So this is another line of the Power of the Force era figures, Power of the Jedi era Force figures, that I never dived into. I'm not sure why, especially since you guys know I love Ewok so much, I you think I would have had this in the past, but I never did pick it up. Um, but they have a few figures like this, and it's really weird. It's called Star Wars Power of the Force. There you go. Complete Galaxy Endor with Ewok. So it's a weird thing, and what turns me off to this is the figure is great, but then you get a little, like, kind of bubble, which I think is like a world. You basically fold it together. It makes a planet, it looks like. We'll see once we dive into it and open it up. Um, really weird. It's like he's flying over Endor, but it's like he's flying... Uh, you know, like in an airplane, like super high. That's how small it looks. Uh, and we know that uh, those uh, Ewoks weren't flying that high in their little uh, stuff they put together. But uh, there's a few other in this line that I remember. I know there's like a Luke with uh, the Sarlacc pit, and then there's um, a Yoda with uh, Dagobah, and one of those like pterodactyl type things flowing over. I think that might be it. I don't know if it says on here. It doesn't look like it does. Um, but I always passed on these. And there might be a droid, like a battle droid or something. I don't know. Anyways, I passed on these back in the day, but then I was at my lo local toy store, $9.99. I said, you know what? Ten bucks. It's worth it just for the Ewok. If I, even if I junk the rest of it and I just keep the Ewok, I'll do that. Uh, the sad thing with this one is the Ewok doesn't even have a name. They weren't good enough to name this Ewok. They couldn't have made something up for here. It's just nameless Ewok number one. So uh, let's see. What, what do we think this Ewok looks like? Take a look at him there in the package. You know what? We're going to name this Ewok after the best dog of all time. And I'm talking about my dog, Lemmy. The guy that saved the collection. If you guys saw a couple weeks ago in my videos, uh, he came and got me. There was a water leak right above where I'm, I'm sitting right now. Water was spewing down. Lemmy came, started giving me the nose to the ribs. I'm like, what do you want? I tried to see if he wanted to go outside. He didn't. He took me downstairs right to where the leak was. Truly lassie moment. And in honor, I'm going to name this Ewok Lemmy. Lemmy the Ewok. There it is. Forever christened. We'll always call him Lemmy from now on. Um, another thing about this box, it's a weird box. It's a weird shaped box. Something different. Doesn't really line up with other things in the Power of the Force collection. Uh, it truly is something different, which I'm not always opposed to, but I do like packaging uniformity. You guys know that. A big window box here, as you can see. And then you got the little Ewok, uh, Ewok, well, Endor. What am I, I'll just call it Ewok. No, it's Endor is the planet. So it's got Endor down here. You got the Star Wars logo. You got Lemmy the Ewok in there with his uh, accessories. You got the planet down there. Complete Galaxy Endor. A nice little glamour shot on the side, of course. And then we got the same glamour shot on the other side. So it looks like it's almost like a base, like a trophy on it from the outside here. I didn't see that. So this whole thing sits on like a little base. There's the top. We know that Darth Vader logo. That just screams power of the force. And we got the back right here. Look at that. There's the whole planet when you uh, close it. So that's what I'll probably end up doing. I'll be closing this thing up. Um, Endor, as we always talk about on the channel, beautiful this time of year. Just absolutely beautiful. If you can get to Endor, I recommend the trip. It's got authentic world markings on here. Removable Ewok with pop open glider. Lemmy the Ewok can fly through Endor. Um, authentic world markings. The Force is with you in the All Star, All Star Wars Complete Galaxies. So there's a Death Star with Darth Vader, Tatooine with Luke Skywalker, and Dagobah with Yoda. So I don't know if I've seen that Death Star Darth Vader. I'm sure I probably have. From 1998 this came out. Um, on the bottom, oh, we got some reading to do. I'm going to read this. I'm going to read it as fast as I can like a young Micro Machines guy. Let's see if I can do it. 
The Endor star system was long thought to be an insignificant removed cluster with few planets and no major travel routes. Well, I don't believe that for one minute. For that reason, it was considered the ideal construction site for the second Death Star battle station and in turn became the location of the Galactic Civil War's final battle. The Battle of Endor resulted in the destruction of the Death Star, the slaying of Emperor Palpatine, or did it, uh, the scattering of the Imperial fleet. Endor's moon, Sanctuary Moon, is home to vast forests of giant trees, many predator species, and tribal Ewoks. The tree-dwelling Ewoks are curious creatures. They stand about one meter tall, rely on primitive spears and bows for hunting, and dwell in village clusters built high within the forest giant trees. Their understanding of forest survivor skills are extremely advanced and came in quite useful during the Battle of Endor, where they helped the Rebel Strike Force destroy the Death Star's force field generator. I need to get the Ewok village. That reminds me. I am missing that. I need to get that back in my collection. I'm going to have to have that as my centerpiece of my Ewok uh, landscape that I'm going to have in my display one of these days. Uh, Lemmy the Ewok will be very happy uh, to be on Endor. Can I cut this open without cutting my fingers? There it is. It's a very cool lot to digest here in this packaging. But as you guys know, we're going to open this up. We open everything. So we got to open this bad boy up. So let's see. They really do care, right there. If you have any questions, please call. I would call, but I don't have another phone. I'm recording on my phone and my other phone's not here. There you go, nothing too fancy special there. See you later. Oh, we got a lot of tape here. There's the old plastic prison of Lemmy. He's ready to take flight. Gotta love those Ewoks. I mean, they really, truly saved the day. I remember those Ewok. There was that, like, Ewok TV movies and, like, TV series. I was all in. I was eating that thing up with a fork and a spoon. I'd even grab a spork from KFC. That's how into that I was. Uh, I know a lot of people, I guess, hate that. Hate those Ewok movies. I absolutely loved them. I haven't seen them in probably 30-some years, but uh, I remember being a little kid, I was all in. Uh-oh. All right. That works. Falling out of the package, uh, the plastic uh, given way. Pop this open. Got a little stand here. See you later. See you later. Goodbye. All right, got a little stand here. Now, what do we got here? I don't even know. So, we got a broken piece of rubber band. Another big broken piece of rubber band. So we're, this is old, obviously. This is an older figure. It's kind of disappointing how strapped in he is. Boy, I don't know. So then you can start closing it and the wings close along with it? I don't know. It looks like there's some stuff to remove. I kind of wonder if I remove this. Let's see here. There we go. A little wire. I'm sure this had to come out, right? They wouldn't leave this wire twist tie in there. Let's see. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, we got to figure it out. So then, okay, well, I don't know. I don't know how I think. I don't know how I feel about this. So, there he is like so. Looks kind of cool as a little display piece. Stick it right here. I guess before I end up breaking this, let's see what it's supposed to look like. So there you go. I mean, that's kind of cool, right? Nice, earthy Endor. Beautiful this time of year. You guys have seen there. You guys have seen pictures of Endor. It's a beautiful place. Uh, there's all kinds of furry creatures to meet you there, like my buddy Lemmy here we're playing with. Uh, but I'm guessing you can fold these back, like so. Yep. Maybe. And then he'll fold right there. And you can fold this whole world on top of him, probably. Yep, I figured. You know, I'm smart. I, I'm like, I got the mind of a 10-year-old. I can figure these things out sometimes. Uh, so there it is. I mean, that's not terrible. I'm going to take old Lemmy the Ewok out of this thing. I might put this on my desk at work. People be like, oh, Kyle, what's that globe? What's that all about? I said, well, glad you asked. This is Endor. This is where I'm traveling on vacation this year. Uh, if I ever get a vacation day this year, which probably not going to happen. I think I've had, I've had one full week of vacation, Monday through Friday off. Uh, the last time I had that was in 2010. So uh, 10 years without a full week's vacation. That's just the way it goes. That's what I signed up for. Uh, hopefully I'll retire very young and I'll just uh, live the dream on the back half. Uh, we'll see if that happens. But uh, pull them open like that. Comes right out. You got a poor ATST down there all broken and damaged. Beaten up. The indoor landscape. I don't know. I, I want to take him out, but I don't want to break this thing. 
It looks like you'd have to cut him out. Do I cut him out? Do I do it? I guess I do. I mean, I'm going to have to display this guy somewhere, right? So I'm going to cut him out. Probably going to regret it because it's probably not going to ever go back the same. It's never going to be as fun and cool, but... Oh well, it was only $10, I guess I can take chances. I don't gamble in life, so. Oh, look at this, this ain't bad. I love it. Hasbro, kudos to you. He just unscrews out of the back there those wings. He's got a little plug, it's like a G.I. Joe backpack. Just plugs on out, and there it is. Look at that. How awesome is this? Oh, Lemmy the Ewok, he's gonna be with the rest of his brethren. And then, uh, you know, you're not playing with this thing, you just fold this bad boy up. There it is, just like so. Close it. Maybe, yep. And you put it on the ball. Look at that. I am all in. I'm all in. This is great. This is the best $10 I've spent in a long time. You got Lemmy out separate. He can join his other Ewok brothers. You got a cool little desk display. I can't recommend this enough. You can find this for $10 all day long by this. Uh, just worth it. I'd pay 10 bucks for Lemmy the Ewok at the end of the day. I wish the glider came out. I'll have to play with it a little more, but it doesn't look like it really comes out. Uh, but that's all right. I'll just use him separate. I get Lemmy with my boy uh, Tebow and Pablo and, of course, Wicket and, you know, all the other guys. What is it? Long, uh, I don't know. There's a lot of Ewoks. You guys know, but I need every single one of them. I need every Ewok toy. I'm going to be an Ewok completionist. I'm going to have a whole Ewok village. It's really my 2021 dream, uh, my Ewok village. So there you go. I can't recommend this enough. You guys tell me, what are your thoughts? Did you have the other ones? Do you have the Yoda one? I know where I can get the Yoda one cheap. I think I can get the Luke one cheap at the same place. I don't know about that Darth Vader one. Uh, do you recommend I pick those up? Would I have the same enthusiasm for my boy Lemmy as I would for those? If you guys know the answer, leave me a comment and let me know. I would, I'm would i dying to find out if I need those or not. But very, very solid Power of the Force. Can't recommend this one strongly enough. I like it a lot. More Ewoks, the better, you ask me. So there you go. Lemmy the Ewok, his glider in Endor, which is beautiful this year, time of year. Uh, when you go, tell them Kyle sent you, and I think they'll give you a, a comp parking and a couple of drink tickets. I believe that's the case. So there you go. So leave me a comment with your thoughts on this one. Don't forget to like the video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. We got new videos every single day, including a bonus Star Wars unboxing every single day. And for my boy Lemmy, the most famous of all Ewoks, I'm Kyle. I'll see you guys real soon.